Germany would rearm dictator. Italy, under dictator Benito Mussolini, steadily grew closer to Nazi Germany. Mussolini soon demonstrated his imperial ambitions by invading Ethiopia and later other parts of Africa. With Germany rapidly growing in military strength and territorial demands, British Prime Minister Neville Chamberlain met with Hitler in 1938 and the two leaders signed a pact giving the Nazis part of Czechoslovakia. This, Chamberlain assured the world, meant peace in our time. While wars and aggression toward Europe and Asia, the United States focused on overcoming the depression that had ravaged its economy. It is my determination to adopt every practicable measure to avoid involvement in war. Peace in our time proved brief. Just a year after Chamberlain and Hitler signed their agreement, German troops invaded Poland, touching off World War II in Europe. Let us therefore brace ourselves to our duties, and so bear ourselves that if the British Empire and its Commonwealth last for a thousand years, men will still say this was their finest hour. As the war in Europe widened, the U.S. remained officially neutral.